and time for us to move on. Absolutely. Lorraine is out at Nate this morning. Good morning. Good morning, Jen. Hello, Shay. Now, Hi. every single device that you just saw that Mike showed you would have a circuit board in it. But the question is, how do you take it from this sheet of copper to a board like this of many different sizes, depending on the device? Well, take a look at the computer and at this machine. Mark, the program at Nate is called the Electronics Engineering Technology Program. What's this piece of equipment all about? That piece of equipment is a printed circuit board router. It takes uh, a design that a, a designer has laid out on a computer and it uh, routes out the copper on the printed circuit board to make room for all the components that need to go on it. What about this piece of equipment over here? This piece of equipment behind us is the piece of equipment that's used to put the parts down. Today's parts are so small that it's very difficult for humans to work with them. So we need this robotic machine here that actually picks up the parts, places them on the board, and some of these parts are just about the size of dust. They're so small. Whoa. So we have to have a machine like this to automatically pick and place the parts. Now, explain this machine to us. This is so cool. This machine is called a 3D printer. It's used to take a design, electronic design, uh, and then print it to turn um, a, a design into an object, basically. It prints it out of plastic. What's it doing right now? Right now, it's making an iPod case. Very cool. And some of the other things that it might produce, these yep. are prototypes. All of these things were designed and printed on a 3D printer. So the, the designer has an idea, he turns it into an actual object. So this is a two-year program. What are the job opportunities? I would imagine the sky's the limit in a program like this. Pretty much, because electronics is in everything. So you could get into electronics uh, design, manufacturing, servicing, installation. You could be working for uh, the automotive industry, the uh, medical industry, the oil field. They all use electronics. So there's over 200 programs that they offer here at Nate. We wanted to give you lots of time to plan coming down because there's going to be 13,000 people coming through these doors in two days. Ruth, this must be huge for you folks in terms of introducing everything that Nate has to offer. Absolutely. This is probably our biggest recruitment event of the year at Nate. And we find that over half of our first year students actually came to Open House and it helped them make their decision about coming here. So it's really important for us. It's a great opportunity to meet current students, instructors and also grads from those programs and find out what you need in order to get into that specific program and what the job prospects look like. Okay. And it's a lot of fun too, Lorraine. There's lots of fun activities here as well. So we've given you lots of advance notice. Mark it on your calendar. Parents come with their children. Kids come in school buses from directly from the schools. It's a very big deal for potential opportunities for students that are graduating. So enjoy your day. We'll see you tomorrow. Sounds great. Thank see you, Lorraine. The Open House is October 14th and 15th. You can call 780-471-NATE or find a link online through our morning news webpage at globaltvedmonton.com.